Hi everyone, and welcome to another video in this channel. Today we're going to be talking about the cost of building the Ocean Gate's Titan submarine. In recent days, the American company Ocean Gate has caused a lot of controversy due to the sinking of its Titan submarine, with which it made trips to see the site of the Titanic wreck. After the tragedy, many people wonder how the submarine was built and how much it cost to build it. In this video, we will answer that question. The cost of building the Titan? The Titan cost about $30 million to build. This includes the cost of the materials, the labor, and the testing. The main materials used in the construction of the Titan are titanium, carbon fiber, and acrylic. Titanium is used for the hull of the submarine because it is strong and lightweight. Carbon fiber is used for the frame of the submarine because it is strong and durable. Acrylic is used for the windows of the submarine because it is clear and allows for good visibility underwater. The cost of the materials. The cost of the materials used to build the Titan is about $15 million. The titanium hull cost about $7 million. The carbon fiber frame cost about $5 million. And the acrylic windows cost about $3 million. The cost of labor. The cost of labor to build the Titan submarine is about $10 million. This includes the cost of the engineers, the technicians, and the other workers who were involved in the construction process. The following are some of the specialists involved in the building of the Titan submarine and their roles. Engineers. Engineers were responsible for designing and overseeing the construction of the submarine. They must have a strong understanding of engineering principles and be able to work with a variety of materials. Technicians. Technicians were responsible for assembling and testing the submarine. They must have a strong understanding of mechanical and electrical systems. Other workers. Other workers involved in the construction of the Titan submarine include welders, machinists, and painters. They must have the skills and experience necessary to complete their specific tasks. The cost of testing. The cost of testing the Titan is about $5 million. This includes the cost of the equipment used to test the submarine, the cost of the personnel who conducted the tests, and the cost of the repairs that were needed after the tests. The breakdown of the costs. Here is a breakdown of the costs of the main pieces or pots of the Titan submarine. The hull. The hull is the outermost shell of the submarine. It is made of titanium and is designed to withstand the pressures of the deep ocean. The cost of the hull is about $7 million. The frame. The frame is the internal structure of the submarine. It is made of carbon fiber and is designed to support the weight of the submarine and its occupants. The cost of the frame is about $5 million. The windows. The windows are made of acrylic and are designed to provide the occupants of the submarine with a clear view of the underwater environment. The cost of the windows is about $3 million. Propulsion system. The propulsion system is responsible for moving the submarine through the water. It consists of electric motors and propellers. The cost of the propulsion system is about $2 million. Life support system. The life support system is responsible for providing the occupants of the submarine with oxygen, water, and heat. It also includes a waste disposal system. The cost of the life support system is about $1 million. Electronics. The electronics system includes the submarine's navigation system, communication system, and cameras. The cost of the electronics system is about $1 million. Miscellaneous. The miscellaneous category includes the cost of items such as tools, spare parts, and insurance. The cost of the miscellaneous category is about $1 million. As you can see, the Titan submarine is a complex piece of machinery that requires a wide range of skills and expertise to build. The cost of labor is a significant factor in the overall cost of the submarine. However, the high cost of labor is justified by the need to ensure that the submarine is safe and reliable. The cost of operating the Titan. The cost of operating the Titan is about $1 million per trip to the Titanic wreck site. This includes the cost of the fuel, the crew, and the other expenses associated with operating the submarine. The total cost of taking a trip to the Titanic wreck site. Before the tragedy, the total cost of taking a trip to the Titanic wreck site was about $260,000 per person. This includes the cost of the submarine ticket, the cost of the accommodations, the cost of the training, and the cost of the other expenses associated with the trip. Conclusion
Nobody knows if the Ocean Gate Company will continue to offer its strips to see the Titanic shipwreck. The authorities must conclude their investigations to determine what went wrong with the submarine and if this had to do with the defect in the materials or a failure in safety. Meanwhile, few submarines, most of them experimental, are capable of reaching such a depth but none of them offer commercial trips, so you will have to wait if you want to venture such a journey. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video about the cost of building the Ocean Gate Titan submarine. What do you think? Do you think the submarine failure had to do with the materials or safety? Post your answer in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this.